What's going on, everybody? This is Joe. And Amy. And we are back with another episode of Minecraft. Welcome to Amy's World. Last time, we were down here in Amy's cave, among other places, but we were down here in Amy's cave working on some vines. Uh, we ran into some issues, but we'll talk about that in a moment. And some flowers. Yes. Slash crimson roots, like uh, nether grass or whatever. Um, and so at the end of the last episode, we had some decisions to make, uh, and mostly Amy had decisions to make. I had work to do, um, because these vines, uh, some of them burned up, um, thereby burning all the rest of them up. Uh, and I was able to catch it towards the end, uh, and save some of them, um, just not a lot of them. And, um, what ended up happening was I, my assumption was because under this obsidian, there was more lava. Because I didn't think it was from the torches, although that's what we thought originally. But uh, So what I ended up having to do was excavate a lot of this area, quell all the lava, uh, and then put the obsidian back. Um, which I did, in between, last episode and this episode. Um, but the other thing that needed to be done, Amy, was that you had said that you wanted to take some time and think about how you wanted this to look. Because your original comment last time was that it looked like there were holes uh, in front of these peonies. Yeah. But that when we added either the... either side of them. Yes. But when we added the alliums and the oxide daisies, you felt like it looked a little bit too busy. Yeah. And, and so we were like trying crap. to... F <laughs> What's that? And kind of like crap. Yeah. So we were trying to find some kind of a happy medium so that you could be happy with what you were seeing, but also still show off these plants and flowers the way that you want to here in this space. So... Uh, what, if anything, have you decided? Well, so we tried putting a cornflower, a poppy, and a dandelion here as well to kind of see how they would look also. And there... So everything but the dandelion is still a full block tall. Yeah. But the dandelion is only a half block tall. And so I'm hoping that by only putting dandelions here in front of these peonies, um, you'll be able to see the peonies nicely, uh, but you'll have more to this than just a whole bunch of dirt, some peonies, and some crimson, crimson root. Okay. So I want to basically take out every other flower that we have here. And replace them all with dandelions. Okay. Aside from the peonies, obviously. Yeah. Basically, I'm hoping that'll make it uh, less of an eyesore. <laughs> okay. But, so you're saying replace them all with dandelions, meaning like every Each, space or right. just the spaces Each, that had flowers in them? No. Each dirt block will get a dandelion. You got it. And hopefully it'll look good when we're done. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that is what it looks like. I actually love that. Yeah, me too, actually. Yeah. That's great. Oops. All right. And so then you just go like that. And you're good. Yeah, we do want to do the vines all the way across this dirt. Yeah. Um, Actually. I don't, I, I thought they would spread, but I don't think they have yet. It's, they're not looking great. The, cause the color of them is so olivey uh, as opposed to like a truer grass green kind of color. Sure. Uh, that you can hardly tell that they're there on top of the dirt. So here's something I they was thinking They show up of. nice on the stone, but the dirt, it's tough to see them. Yeah. So here's something I was thinking of that might be a little bit tough, but I kind of want to try it. So we have done some enchantments, and I've mentioned this enchantment many times. And I don't want to do this a lot, um, but there is such an enchantment known as silk touch and we've talked about this before with stone mostly right because a lot of the stuff that we have 
uh, like that we made with regard to this um, dance floor, dance club, or whatever you want to call it, was made with stone. Yeah. Um, and you had said, like, why is it so annoying that, you know, all this cobblestone or all this stone just becomes cobblestone when we break it? And I said that the only way it wouldn't do that is if you, um, oh, thank God. Okay. Is if you, um, did it with, uh, if you broke the stone with silk touch. And the only way to get that is through enchanting. So try to lead all these folks away from our front door and hopefully kill them all. But. Yeah, if I recall when you mentioned that, we were not very high on levels, I feel like. So we just... I thought it wasn't the best idea to try and enchant things at the moment. Sure. I could be wrong on that, but we're now at level 34, so I think I'd be okay with enchanting things. Okay. Got him. Come on, skeleton. Okay. There was an Enderman over there, but he's gone now as well. Okay. Well, anyway. All right. We don't have space for any of this stuff. Um, Just throw out some of the flowers. Throw them out? Yeah. Like, like forever? Yeah. Which ones? Uh, the white tulips. There's four of them. Just throw them out. Goodbye. And just take things we actually want, like the flint. That was gunpowder. Whatever. <laughs> yeah, see if there's more under the tree. Oh, there's an enchanted bow over there, it looks like. Oh, Maybe. that'd be something cool. So what else do we want to toss? Um, I could just put this stuff away. But... Just, just put the bed down on the ground, place it, and then we'll come back for it later. And we picked up the arrow. No, uh, I picked the... Up the... Flesh. Yeah. We're so, so fleshy. So this bow has unbreaking one. It's got very little left in it, but it's still got unbreaking one, which is cool. Cool. All right. Um, okay. So anyway, so uh, what we want to do is, I, like I said, I want to try something. I do end up having to, I am going to end up having to put this stuff away anyway. Um, all right. We had most of our flowers up here, I think. Is that correct? I believe, yeah. All right, so let's just put all of these away. Okay, and we'll put, you want the roots and the vines here too? Or because they're from the nether, you want them elsewhere? Separate. Uh, were they over here? Is that I don't we... believe so, no. We have our nether ward here. Oh, yeah, take that out. Because we'll you put... Yeah, we put it near the nether rack, but we're going to put this together in a different area. All right, so do you want this stuff here then? No. You want it in an entirely new cabinet? I think. Sounds fine to me. Okay, so those are our fishing rods. So you want it on the bottom or the top? I'm trying to think what's going to make the most sense. Because, like, this bottom one has just fishing rods in it. This has... Um, our wool, our dye, and our carpets, as well as our ink sacks, so like a lot of our coloration type things. Uh, and up here is nothing, um, but it does show wool on the little symbol above to tell us what's in there. Right. Um, and then again, this is fishing rods, and this is nothing, and I believe nothing is in any of these other ones as well. Right. Well, fine. Put it in a nothing cabinet, and I don't care if it's top or bottom. Okay. All right, so we'll do that, we'll do that, and we'll do that. Yeah. Uh, then we want to come over here for gunpowder. And then we've got stone and dirt, but I think we're okay in that regard. All right, um, so you mentioned the silk touch. Would you be willing to explain that a little more? Happily, yeah. So basically what silk touch does is when you break a block or an object or something. I don't want any of this rotten flesh. Oh. And you don't want these either? No. Okay. Sorry. Just leave it all behind. Okay. Um, when you break a block or something, most of the time, whatever you've broken, you pick up. Right? But there are certain blocks that break into other blocks. I just gave the example of 
stone into cobblestone. But also, and the one that matters for what I'm trying to uh, work with here for you, is, um, I don't know if it's going to, we're not going to be able to enchant that shovel. I'm going to have to make another random shovel here. Um, but we can go with, um, let's see. But, sorry, but um, when you break a grass block, you get dirt. Yeah. But if you break a grass block with silk touch, you get a grass block. Oh, okay. So, and if you break, so like I was saying, if you break stone with silk touch, you get stone as opposed to cobblestone. Okay, so then we... But we'd be able to place a, a dirt block with grass on it so that the grass was on the side instead of on the top? No, but it will still give you that grass distribution in a cave because grass blocks spread. So it will be on the side, not the... Or it will be on the top, not the side, but at least you'll have that bit of green that you're looking for. That you were talking about no no i i wouldn't I, I just want the side to be more aesthetically pleasing it doesn't even have to be green i just want it to be a color um uh well you could put banners could but i hate it i know um but you could put green banners can you put a rug like like the area rug can you put that sort of sideways like like up on the side of it so i don't believe so but we literally have rug right in front of us let's experiment and find out so if we take this piece of rug and we go over here to the wall and we click does no. not okay no only on the floor but okay let's let the cat out so i can go and get us stuff that's only when we sleep oh so it's just being oh very shit vocal. there's just a creeper right there all right well get away from our house and come over here come on come this way the hell is in the water over there? I don't even know what that is. I think it might just be like some kind of tropical fish, but... Oh god, it's gonna blow up. Oh, thank god. Thank god. Okay. What are these yellow things? I don't know. Oh, yeah, they're just tropical fish. Okay. They're pretty. Yeah. I love them. Yeah. They're in our pond. That's right. And a dolphin's in here with us, too. That's not... See? Realistic, but yes. <laughs> I see. And it's helping us swim faster. All right, anyway. Thank you, dolphin. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> um, okay, all right. So then we won't need to do silk touch. Um, but yeah, like I said, you could do banners if you want. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Because the banners do kind of inherently move a little but it's only a little and you can't see that from the front mm -hmm. it's not obvious that it moves like now that you know that it does you probably see it but yeah it's not like too blatantly obvious in my opinion um or Matt hmm and we can't put ink on it right dye on what um, dirt. Mm, I, again, am almost certain that we cannot, <laughs> but let us experiment. So we put a piece of dirt down. We take a color of dye. We have a lot of red. So let's take a color of red dye. Whoops. Well, fine. Um, so there are two ways of trying it. We can try it with, like, combining it that way. No. Uh, or we can try it uh, in an open hand and clicking. 
Nope. Um, and even if we take the torch off, no. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, maybe we should do banners. Okay. Because, I mean, we used the leaves outside, but that was, like, when we... That was over didn't here. Didn't need to have dirt there. With the chickens. Because it was... it We could replace the dirt block with a grass block. Yeah. That music was terrifying. Yeah, it really was. Holy crap. <laughs> Did not like that. <laughs> Come on, cat. Back in the house. Thank you. It's scary out there. Yeah, I don't like it hot. <laughs> Spooky. Okay. Um, hmm. Just ugh. <laughs> um, just wish those green vines were a brighter green. That's sure. it. Sure. That's all I want. Um, By the way, this unbreaking one that we got—that's like super low on durability. Yeah. You can combine it with your medium durability one, or a little bit above medium, okay. and get almost a full one with unbreaking one. That sounds great. Let's do it. <laughs> It costs you three levels, but... Not bad. I think it's worth it. I was like, the cat was pushing us a moment ago. Oh, it's sitting near the fire, of course. Cats love the warmth. All right. Well, anyway, now we can go to sleep. Cat, are you getting us anything? See, the cat sleeps with us. I wanted to sleep with me. Why? Wanted to get me stuff. It got you a rabbit's foot. Oh, well, thank you, cat. <laughs> what do I do with a rabbit's foot? Uh... Put it in a cabinet and never see it again. <laughs> if I had to guess. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm pretty sure we have one already. So there's a cabinet that where it should already exist. Easy for you to say. God, we have so much stuff. I'm pretty okay. sure we did have it. Maybe we threw it away when we... Needed space for something, but... <coughs> yeah, it would make sense in, like, the livestock area or in the mob leavings area. And it is in neither. Hmm. Okay. Well, we'll just put it in the mob leavings. You got it. Cat, you doing okay? Come on. Get over here. <laughs> Go back to bed. Your bed's over here. You were up all night getting a rabbit's foot. It was a very good job you did. <laughs> this cat's bed is bigger than mine. Yep. <laughs> Get on That's your still, own bed. I was going to say, it still goes on yours. <sighs> it's huge. Get on your bed. <laughs> Get up. Did you just try to die, my cat? No, I'm trying to get it to get up. I just don't want to click it with... Um... All right, come on. This way, please. Thank you. Okay. Now, come this way now. No. Th it's on my chair. Wait. Okay. <laughs> Just push it on. Yep, sure do. Okay. <laughs> done and done. <laughs> Okie doke. <sighs> well, we lived through that. Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, banners or no banners? Um... Yeah, I guess we can do some banners. <sighs> we don't really have green dye. Um, Again, I don't need it to be green. I just don't want that much brown. Okay. Where it's like blatantly dirt. <laughs> All right. Well, you've got purple, red, or blue. But there's no like metallic ones, right? Like a. I mean, there's like a copper or a gold. There's light gray and there's white. Um, I guess it's not showing it right now. Hold on. If I go over here, sorry about that noise in the background, everybody. Um, if we can check dye colors, there's pink, there's magenta, there's light gray, there's cyan, 
There's gray. Your cyan would be pretty. This one? Yeah. So you need blue and green to make cyan. Okay. Don't we have that? Uh, we don't have green because you need to make it. But I think we have some cacti because you make it with cacti. Oh, okay. Uh, there's orange. There's just plain blue. There's white. There's red. There's black. Um, there's light blue. Uh, just trying to make sure I'm not missing any. There's purple. There's lime. Uh, I think that's it. All right, so you want cyan? You want blue and green? No, I think oh. we have the green, the lime, so we can use the lime. We have the lime? Where do we have the lime? You just read we had it. No, those were options of possible dye that exist in the game. Oh, I see. <laughs> I was just trying to give you every option available to you. Okay, well, <laughs> I think we have what we need to make the... Cyan. Lime is just green and white. Oh, okay. So maybe we do have that. Um, well, I didn't see any cacti. Oh, we have 30. Perfect. <laughs> Helpful. All right. So the question, though, is... Oh, God. We did this a long time ago. How the hell do you make a banner? <laughs> God damn it. Um, do we need the loom for it? I don't believe oh, right there. so. Yeah, so you need wool on top of stick, uh, a single stick. Okay. So if you want it to be lime, then you get lime, you dye the wool lime, and then uh, you put it on top of a single stick, and you get a lime banner. My question was going to be, I think I'm going to have to go down below and count how many we need. Uh. They are too long, and since you're... Um, thing of dirt is too high that's perfect because then you just put one banner per uh column Section. basically um so that's helpful yeah i'm thinking i might want to skip i'll do every other so one. like banner dirt banner dirt banner or whatever sure sounds good all right i don't know if it's an even number or an odd number but it will find out in a moment um but if it is do you want more dirt or do you want more banner <laughs> Um. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. So you will have an odd number. Okay. So, one more dirt than banner. Great. That's uh, easier. <laughs> uh, but that means that we go dirt. Banner one, dirt two, dirt three, dirt four, dirt five, dirt six, dirt seven, dirt eight, dirt nine, dirt. So we need nine uh, lime banners. Yeah, I'm thinking about doing the ombre thing again. Oh, okay. From what to what? I don't know. Do you think it would do the orange? Do we have orange? Uh, if we don't have it, again, we can, can make, make it. it. Yeah, I want, like, Oops. orange and green. Orange and green. Well, lime. Sure, sure, sure. Um, whoops. Come on now. Really? Uh-oh. Why is it being so difficult all of a sudden? Get out of here. Okay. Orange and lime. So... Um, let's check. We need... Maybe one cyan one in the center. Full cyan? Yeah. Okay, so then we need green, blue, white. Don't we get white dye from bone meal, is that correct? Yes, it is. Okay. So I guess I'll have to figure out how much of that we need. Okay. Um, what did I say? Nine banners? Yes. Is that correct? Okay. So, and we have the wool. 
We only have 16 white wool. But thankfully, we have sheep. Hey, Are sheep. Are going to need more than 16? It's six wool per banner. Oh. I thought <laughs> it was two. No, it's six. Um, Move cows. That's fine, I got it. Yeah, that just gave us three. Trimmy, trim, trim. That gave us three as well. And there's another one over here. Out of the way, boys. Or girls, I guess, because they're cows. Uh, perfect. No. <laughs> Bad. Okay. Now we have 25. So if we do six times nine, that's what? Um, oh God, come on. I'm 56, much better at this. 54, 52? 54, you're right. <laughs> it was 50 something. <laughs> yeah, it's 54, but that means that's how much wool we need. So we need to over double what we have right now. Oh Jesus, okay. Um, whoops. Yeah. All right, well, let's start with what we've got. Uh, okay. Um, It'll give the sheep a chance to grow some more fluff. Correct. All right. So we'll put the cacti. Excuse me? What am I missing? How do you make green dye? Am I stupid? I thought it was cactus. Uh, that's lime. Where's the green dye? Obviously I had it because I have recipes for things that need green dye. So how am I missing green dye? Are you kidding? Huh. Do I have to Google this? Like it's supposed to be here. It was there. Well, I, but we're not looking for green, we're looking for lime. Again, but to make lime you need green. I need uh. to know how to make green dye. And for cyan we need green, so I need to know how to make green dye. Um, great. I guess I have to look it up online because I can't, I might have passed it like three times, but I can't see it. So, um, oh. that's super annoying. Okay. Anyway, green dye. Um, how do you make green dye? Yeah. So we'll do eight of the green and orange banners and we'll do one cyan banner. Okay. For the center. I... I don't... Oh. We have to cook the cacti. Oh. Apparently. Oh, bedtime. <sighs> Sorry, I didn't get the cat. My bad. You just sleep with the shears. Yeah. It's like running with them. Okay, here we go. We'll cook them up. That was my other thought, but yeah. So we get green dye. We did it. Awesome. In fact, I'll speed up the process and split it up. All right, so we have uh, one green, two green dye already. I'll take them both for now. Now we have new recipes that we've unlocked. Great. Awesome. Um, okay, so we want green ombre into orange is that correct we want lime ombre into orange okay so then i will make four cyan dye right you said yeah. we wanted we want six cyan total oh. okay um so then we just need, whoops, one more of those, which makes six total. Nice. Uh, and then we need lime, which is green and white. And we need uh, eight banners of that, which means we need... <sighs> 48... 48 um, lime dye. So we'll go like that. That's four. We're, we're sure are getting there. Uh, and it's two per, so we need 24. Yikes. Of this. It's 
plot. Okay, we're done there. 24 of that. Yeah, we're at 12. Oh, I think I might have um, not counted the ones in my inventory already. But that's fine. We can make this work. So then green, white. Now we're at 36. We need 48. So 12 more, which means six of each. Come on. Five. Come on. Almost there. <laughs> you can do it. Six. Whew. Okay. So yes, I did miscount, but not by too much. We now have 48. And two white die left over for the hell of it, I guess. All right. Which means that we want to dye all of this wool lime. Oh, we don't have enough wool. Right. Because we're still trying to get more from the sheep. Sheep, have you regrown your coats yet? <laughs> yep, they sure have. Yay. Convenient. It is nice having sheep. Right? Let's shear them. It's one. Or three, I guess. Six. Nine. Okay. Look at how naked they look. Okay. Uh, so yeah, there we're good here for now. Oh, ha <laughs> ha! How convenient is that? Thanks, friend. <laughs> just need to give it a little trim. What? I just needed to give it a little trim. Yeah. So uh, we're most of the way there. We've got thirty-six out of the forty-eight that we need right now. Okay. And then obviously we'll need another six after that, but still. Uh, Grow are back. Guys, are you guys gonna eat? Are you hungry? Or no? The horse is eating. See, do what he's doing. Look. <laughs> no. Nobody. Okay. Oh. Got him. Yeah. Nice. Should have brought some wheat and breeded some of these uh, sheep so that we could have done this faster. Yeah. Although, to be fair, waiting for one of the babies to grow up probably would not have been the best plan either. But... No. Probably oh! not. Got one. Thank you. 41 out of 48. Seven more. Nice. Four more. I was like, where's the other one? <laughs> we should put some bone meal on them. On the sheep? <laughs> <laughs> so that the wool will grow. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be very stupid if that worked. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it would. <laughs> I'm watching you. One of you is going to do it eventually. If I know anything about animals, it's that they love eating. <laughs> And that includes humans. Well, that's fair. Speaking of which, we could go over to our little farm area and harvest some stuff. Do we have space? In our inventory? Yeah. Yeah, sort of. So let's go harvest some things. Okay. I was just going to walk around the backside there, but you, okay. You, you can't. You can't get out. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> oh, no. Get over here. Get, get over it. Fine. It did it, too. And we have 47 out of 48. <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> God damn it. Why? <laughs> Fine, let's try this again. Okay. Well, this way, when we come back over here, we can shear them all. All right. Well, we've got the 48 that we need and two out of the six that we need. Okay, so here are your potatoes, yeah. your beets, yes. and your carrots, and your wheat, of course, and then your pumpkin patch and your watermelon patch. Okay. So let's harvest some stuff. What would you like to harvest? Uh, let's do some potatoes. Taters. Whoops. I love potatoes. <laughs> okay. 
Are we planting more? Yeah. Okay. So we'll plant right where we got them from. And I don't know if we've talked about this type of yield yet, but um, out of two, four, six, eight uh, pieces of land with potato, yeah. we now have 22 remaining after replanting eight. Wow. That's incredible. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. Okay. Let's do beets. You got it. So with the beets, if you recall, there's beets and there's beetroot seeds. So they're different. But beets are root vegetables and they do not have seeds. They're, they're root vegetables. I don't know what to tell you. But you have 11 <laughs> beetroot and 30 beetroot seeds. Okay. And so... There were 11 patches here, so you mm -hmm. got exactly 11 um, beetroot from here, but 30 seeds. Okay. Okay. Carrots, wheat, or uh, nothing? Yeah, let's do some carrots. Okay. So... Four, five, six, seven, eight. Out of eight plots of land for carrots, we now have 25 remaining after replanting eight. Nice. All right. Well, let's head on over to the wheat here. Yeah. We'll harvest some wheat. Okay. Yeah, we still should have enough room. Okay. And so, I don't know if you recall this, but... Uh-oh. That's going to be a problem. I don't think I'm going to be able yeah, to get just leave it there. Okay. Who cares? Uh, so we've got 32 wheat mm -hmm. and uh, 80 wheat seeds Jeez. from that. Okay. Well, let's plant some of them and put the rest in the house, I guess. <laughs> Can we eat the seeds? No. God damn it. <laughs> you cannot. This uh, game does not support a healthy lifestyle. I believe <laughs> you can either eat pumpkin seeds or then roast pumpkin seeds and eat oh, them. Oh, really? I think so. That's cool. I'd have to double check, but... What about watermelon seeds? Uh, there's not watermelon seeds. There's melon slices or the full lemon. Or me lemon. Melon. Sorry. <laughs> Jesus. Yes, lemons. <laughs> the full water lemon, you know. <laughs> oh, one of you hasn't grown their coat back. Thank you. Thank you. What's the matter? You're not hungry? Let's breed. Oh, yeah. Now that we have wheat. Everybody's going to crowd us now if we try this, but... Okay, I got one. Let's go over to the other. Quick, 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 quick. Okay. Are you going to find the other one? No? That's annoying. Fine. You too. Okay. Good. <laughs> All right. They did it. You get to just have eaten weed, I guess. Congrats. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Sleep time. Yeah. Why does the moon look like that? What do you mean? It's like a rectangle. <laughs> Everything in this world is a rectangle. Or a, I mean, well, like, instead of a square. Well, because it's, um, you know, it's like a um, crescent moon. Oh. Just based on where the... Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's like, it's like smeared. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good. We have exactly what we need now. Perfect. Okay. Well, then. Let's, Did something uh, just fall on the ground outside our door? No. Uh, when you walk, you kick stuff up sometimes. Ah. Um, okay. So we want to take the wool, and we want to take 48 lime dye, and we get lime wool. Nice. Then we take the cyan dye, and we get cyan wool. Yay. Done. Uh, okay. But now we want green and orange banners, you said, right? Yeah. I mean, I think the green will probably sort of ombre into the cyan a lot nicer than the orange will. Yeah, but we didn't do that. Right? Or you mean, 
green and orange versus green and cyan. Right. Okay. So, like, we can do, like, one orange banner, and then the rest of the banners can be green and cyan um, braided into each other. Okay. All right. Uh, well, we need sticks. We've got 39. That should be plenty. Okay. okay. So we want... All right. Sorry, you're going to have to go over this <laughs> again. Oh. Okay. <laughs> That's on me. Sorry, everybody. Did we, did we do the orange yet? No. Okay. So... Uh, How do you get orange dye? Am I stupid? Maybe red and yellow <laughs> dye to make orange dye? Uh, oh, there's orange right there. Is that right. dye? No, the one above it. Oh, yeah. Ah, orange tulips. That makes oh. perfect sense. Yeah, we have some of those. Uh, we sure do. Whoops. Or did we use them? I oh, know. We have 27 orange tulips. Awesome. Okay. But if we need like to, that. if we want to ombre them with the lime, we're going to need a lot more orange tulips. No, that's what I'm saying. Well, oh, but we only need six cyan. Yeah. So that doesn't work. We have to ombre it with the lime. Because we only made six cyan. I mean, we can make more cyan. Like, there's more wool, and we would just need to get more green dye. It's up to you. Yeah, I think I would like it better if it was more cyan. Okay. Let's cook that up, and let's double check and see if we have more cacti as well. Um, I don't know that we do. All right, I guess we're going exploring. Do you offhand remember where the nearest um, desert is? Desert. Yeah, because that's where we have to go to get the cacti. <laughs> oh. Um, well, yes. You do? Yes. Okay. Um, so where is it? The... I mean, obviously there's sand here, but that's not helpful. Uh... But around that way, you think? It was, it was near that first pirate ship we did, because then there was like a whole area where all the rabbits were and shit. Oh, okay. Well, that's that's out that way. I thought. No. It's that direction from our beach. Yeah. Okay. Right. I, I don't beach. know which direction it is. I just know like what other things are near it. You know. Okay. Sure. Um, but yeah, it was near the first pirate ship we ever did, I think. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's that way. Okay. And our boat is still here, so. Well, on our private our beach. our boat on our private beach, that's so right. it better not be gone. <laughs> uh, Otherwise, we need better security. Yeah. Yeah, we do. <laughs> We're not good enough security in our own house. <laughs> <laughs> hey, having a security system is nothing to, you know... It's true. It's very true. Be, like, not okay about, like, <laughs> I'm not proud because I need a security system. Yeah. Like, that's that makes no sense. You're right. You're absolutely right. <laughs> By the way, you were also right. Cacti, 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 nice. cacti. It's all over the place. I can see it from okay. here. And you were also right about the direction. Well, you were the one that described where it was. Well, so. you were the one that knew which way. <laughs> um... All right, so. <laughs> we have new recipes okay, for boats sure. now. It's, um, the game has updated since we last played, I guess. Uh, I see. <laughs> I was like, how soon you forget, game. <laughs> how soon you forget. Yeah. Oh, look at all those cacti. Yeah. All right. Are yeah, see, so there's be... a... Very There's... cacti rich. Yeah. There's the ship right there. Yeah. Where we put, where we put our pillar of sand <laughs> to remind us that we've already been there. That's how I do it. All right. Oh. There's a cave. Oh. 
Okay. Well, we're not going in there right now. We sure aren't. But we can remember that for the next episode, maybe. <laughs> so we'll so see you. if we do. Yeah, but... how many times have we said that? Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> we'll do it next time. And then, like, six weeks later, we're like, we're doing this today. Wow. That cactus just broke our boots. <laughs> Wow, mm, those were some flimsy fucking boots. <laughs> yeah, or just very damaged. Wow, that's very funny. That's hilarious. Okay, well, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> that's all well and good, I suppose. Yeah. Okay. How many do we have now? 67. Wow. I think that should be enough. All right, well. Worst comes to worst, it's not that far from home. Yeah, I mean, this seems like we've got a lot here, and I, I don't think we're going to end up with, you know, a ton of banners here to just to cover the edge of that thing, so. Yeah. Our dirt blocks. Yeah. All right. Whoops. There we go. I was like, we're going swimming <laughs> while holding a boat. Yep. Okay. That makes sense. That's how it works. <laughs> yep. Okay. We are going home. It's this way. Yeah, technically, if you swamp your boat, you have to do that, right? If your boat flips and you're in the water... You've got to, like, lift it up out of the water to make sure it's fully drained of water before you flip it back over. But mm -hmm. at that point, you're swimming, so. Yeah. Look at our big-ass tree. Look at that area where there's a... There's cobble and dirt. Did we put that there? Where? Right there. No. Weird. It's not cobble. It's just uh, gravel. Oh. See? Oh, yeah. But yeah, now we're back home. Yeah, I thought you were talking about over here. I'm like, yeah, of course we put that there. <laughs> no. <laughs> I know what that shit is. <laughs> Good. <laughs> okay. Um, all right, but now we have to, whoops. If we're going to do this, let's do it right. Um. Take this. Go like this. Okay. Go shear some sheep. Yeah, shearing. I want to be Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran. <laughs> Ed Sheeran sheep. Okay. And the third. Really? There we go. Okay. Ed Sheeran the third. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well. We can breed them again. We still have the wheat. Look at you. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, it tells you we kind of get overrun. Okay. Goodbye. Oh. Oh. Actually, oh, one of the babies grew up. Yeah. Or, yeah, the the first baby grew up, I guess. Cows, could you get the hell out of here? Here, look, we I have tasty wheat. Breed. What? We can make them breed. Yeah. You want to? Yeah. Okay. Okay. There you go. Do some sheep again. Uh, I would have to know which two didn't just breed. Oh. Because they can only do it. Yeah, that one's done already. That one's done already. So it's these two. You and... Oh, dear God, it's a nightmare. You. Okay, thank God we did it. <laughs> oh, God. All right, it's dark. Go home. I know there was another one to shear, but I gotta go. Hurry. We can make some extra wool so we can make ourselves a bed. <laughs> 
What do you mean, make ourselves a bed? Are we missing a bed? No, we're holding so it in our hands. So why do we have to go inside, then? Well, I didn't feel like trying to find it and setting it up among all the animals. It'd be so loud and dirty. Well, <laughs> maybe we like it loud and dirty. Wow. Now, while we're trying to sleep, we don't. <laughs> <laughs> that makes one of us. Congrats, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I heard it. Where? No. Okay, fine. Oh, has it just been you? God damn it. Hungry babies. Yeah, they just keep eating their grass. Yeah, okay. It's the loudest shit in here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we need to make another pen for the sheep. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Uh, okay, where would you like to make the other pen for the sheep? I don't know. Maybe over there on that side of this pen? Oh, just... Near the stairs? Sure. Okay. Like here? Yeah. Okay. Uh, on the lower level or... Put some dirt and make it up on that same level. No, put some dirt and make it up on that same level. I think that'll make it easier, right? I. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I don't think it really matters. It's up to you. Yeah, so we'll keep it on the same level. Okay. So then what we'll do is we can shovel this row here to the end. Okay. Just so that we can then just continue this fence along. Sure. Does that make sense? Yeah. there. Boo. <laughs> it's fine. I mean, we literally just cut a bunch of it, so. Um, or dug, I guess, a bunch of it. It's not cutting, but still. Cutting a rug. Wow. You do make rugs with wool, so. <laughs> yep. Alright. Uh, so we want a couple of blocks here. And then just fill it in. We'll have to get more from inside, obviously. I think how we're going inside our house to get more dirt. Yep. <laughs> to bring outside. Yep. Oh, no. Okay. And you. Thank you. Okay. Could you guys get away from the entrance? I need to get out of here. Everybody move on over here. <laughs> Got her. Hell yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's eat. If you laughed even a little, leave it in the comments. <laughs> All right. Um, guys done yet? Ooh, look at me. It's like I knew. <laughs> So you're first. Bam. Good experience for that. Nice. So we go from here. Yeah. To oh, there. Sick. That's a lot of experience too. Yeah. I'm surprised. All right. Pleasantly surprised. Yes. Okay. All right. So. Uh, what do we do to make the blue dye? Oh, we've got 17 more. We have blue. Uh, so we need the corn flowers. Oh, okay. To make blue we've dye. We've got a zillion of them. See? Yeah. So, I'm sorry. So then, I, I've asked you this a million times, and I truly apologize to everyone who's like, Joe, she's told you already, it's this. But, Amy, would you be willing to explain to me again uh, what we're doing with the um, with banners. these banners? Okay. So, you know how our banner that's hanging above our bed over here on the right-hand side? Yeah. Is yeah. a red and yellow ombre banner. Mm -hmm. So I would like to make a cyan and green ombre banner. Uh, well, a bunch of them. And then one that is just orange. So the orange one will go in the center. And then the cyan and green uh, ombre ones will go on either side of the orange. Cyan and green. Yeah. 
and green and orange. No, just orange. Just orange. Just orange. And we want two just orange. No, we want one just orange in the center. (laughs) And then everything to the left of it and everything to the right of it will all be blue and green, or cyan and green, ombre. (laughs) Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Okay. I, I, I did change it, so... There is reason for you to be confused because right. I originally was doing the green and uh, orange. orange ombre, but now so I now did. we're just doing one orange and the rest cyan and green. Yes, that is what I would like. Okay, and do you know offhand if you want cyan at the top or at the bottom? Uh, like see how I it's... do not. You don't know yet. No. Okay. I guess just try to make them in whichever direction it is, is the direction it is. Fair enough. Um, (laughs) All right, so it did say that I could make a loom. Okay. So, oh, right. Uh, So let's do this first. We've been eating baked potatoes. Okay. So let's go ahead and cook up some more baked potatoes. Perfect. Now that we have these potatoes on us. Um, I don't need this white dye anymore. At least I don't think we do. So let's go over here and put the bone meal away. Nope. Okay. So put away the bone meal with the bones. Now our dyes are here. Yes, they are. Nice. Put the white dye where it belongs. Uh, I guess we'll need the blue. Yeah, because so to make, to make cyan. the cyan, we need green and blue, right? Uh, y- 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 yes. Or did we need white and blue? No, nope, you were right. Green and blue. Okay. So then, but this is lime, not green. Oh, Okay, right, because so green need... is this. Oh, okay, so that's what we were using the white for. We were yeah. putting that with the green to make the lime. Yeah. Okay, so for the cyan, we just need the green that we have to the right here mm-hmm. and the blue. Mm-hmm. Okay, awesome. So let's make some cyan. Okay, um, that's easy enough. We just go like this and like this. So now we have two. I guess we can just use up those couple of greens, yeah. yeah. Okay, so we have 12 now. Um, all right, so while I was thinking about it, I wanted to go in here, grab these boots, since we need boots. They have Curse of Vanishing, but it just means that if we die while wearing these boots and we come back to get our gear, these will not be there. No. Yeah. In the grand scheme, who, but those who are the only boots we have? No. Because I didn't want to use... Oh, but those are almost gone. Correct. Because I was going to say, I didn't want to use gold boots unless we were going to the nether, but... Oh, I see. Yeah, I mean, we've look at it. We've got all these gold chest plates and uh, leggings, though. Okay. Yeah, so. so that's fine. I didn't realize we had so many gold things. Yeah. Um, all right, so our armor is here. Might as well do that, because we found that leather tunic from killing an enemy i assume oh weird okay i don't remember it's been long enough um stone goes up here i suppose correct oh but one got away from me okay um let's try to put away the rest of this stuff so that we can declutter my brain at the same time Mm -hmm. um as as we declutter our inventory hey that's life man (laughs) Yeah. Declutter your house, declutter your life. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if I've told this story on on um the the channels before, but uh I was interning at uh an office and the office was messy. I mean like so messy all the time. And I was not in a position like it wasn't my job to clean the office they never asked me to and i wouldn't have offered because that wasn't the type of internship that i was doing um i want to i was there to actually learn so i wanted to like actually learn as opposed to like you know doing janitorial tasks and again that's not to besmirch janitorial folks it's just that that's not what i was there to do uh and so um i'm trying to figure out where these go we just put them here in the pantry Uh, right um thank you very much you're welcome uh so um i remember 
that I was just so frustrated working there so often with how messy things were that one day I came home and I never had a desire to do this before, like ever. But I just like cleaned my whole apartment because I was just like, I'm so like upset with how everything is. I just needed to be clean. And so sure. I just cleaned the whole apartment top to bottom. <laughs> I was just like, this is, this is stupid. I can't deal with this anymore. I have a somewhat similar story to that. Um, for a very short time, like under a week, I worked at Subway Sandwich Shop. Okay. And um, they had a very tiny sink for a food establishment that goes through a lot of dishes. Um, and so I... Basically, uh, I was there for like three days or whatever it was, and um, the manager was angry with me because I really hadn't learned how to make any of the sandwiches <laughs> because I spent so much time doing dishes mm. because the sink was constantly overflowing <laughs> with dirty dishes. And it's like, why isn't there an industrial freaking sink a, no dishwasher oh di- got gotcha. you yeah, yeah. It, like this is a restaurant sure. i understand that it's you know a fast food restaurant where like and maybe you feel like you don't dirty a lot of dishes because people aren't like eating off of plates and things here sure. and using like silverware and stuff like that but like anytime we would make anything the, the we'd end up with dishes yeah and like it's not you know the 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 typical dishes you know but we'd put something in the oven basically and then we'd take it back out and we had all this stuff to wash sure and three things would fit in the sink and then it would be overflowing and it would be so messy and there'd be not enough space for all of these dirty dishes everywhere <laughs> And it would just bug me so bad. And I just like couldn't. I'm the type of person I can't work at a dirty workstation sure. or a disorganized workstation. So sure. if it's like, you know, I I live in a house at, or a home quite frequently that is messy. <laughs> but I can't do work in an area that is like that. Sure. Because then I can't focus on what I'm trying to do. All I can focus a, it on is is how the mess shouldn't be there and it needs to be fixed. Gotcha. So um, that's all I was doing. I was doing dishes and doing dishes and doing dishes. And and they would get dirtied so quickly that I would do the dishes and then there'd be more to do and there'd be more to do and there'd be more to do and it just never ended. Yeah. And I was just like, I can't, I can't do this anymore, <laughs> you know. And the and the manager was pissed because he was like, okay, I've been trying to teach you these sandwiches, and I've t- uh, like explained to you a couple of times how to make these sandwiches, but like you're not practicing them. All you're doing is dishes. And I'm like, yeah, but look at this fucking mess. Like I can't work. <laughs> yeah. Uh, with this mess like this, and so. They decided that I shouldn't work there anymore. And uh, I was fine with that uh, to a degree. Yeah. Um, But then they tried to um, not pay me for the time that I had worked. I think I remember Um, that. And my mom went in there and uh, like threatened them um, (laughs) in some kind of way. I don't (laughs) really remember exactly what she said, but she was just like... We are not leaving until you pay her, you know. Um, and they gave me cash out of the cash register, and we <laughs> left, um, never to return. Um, Amazing. So, yeah, <laughs> that's really cool. Yeah, one yeah. of the few uh, good things my mom ever really did. Sure. Besides, have you? Ugh. Sorry, sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. Gross. <laughs> You're yeah, that, and that was not a good decision for her to have made. <laughs> she really did not want kids at all. Yeah. Like, in hindsight, 
um, that was a poor choice of hers. Sure. So we need Acacia Gates. Yes. Oh, we've also we got to should make... have some gates left. Probably. We've got to make like a little entry area too. Yeah. How big is this one? One, two, three more posts? Okay. I'll give you that. So, one, two, three. Is that right? It's here? Yes. Okay. And then like this. Mm. Okay. Oh, in fact, yeah, I but need then... space for the gate. Uh, I think I'm one off, actually. This way. It's got to be one over. I think it's here. Yeah. Okay. But yes, you're right. We need these two for the gates. And then this closes it off like that. Okay. Nice. I'm doing things. I'm doing things. <laughs> um, 17. Well, that's a case of fence. We need, we need the gates. Gosh darn. I could have um, sworn we had some left. Maybe we used them? Probably. Somewhere. Um, all right, so the oak fence is over here. We'll just go like that. The lever can go up top like so. We'll put the sticks away. Or maybe the gates are in the different cabinet. So sticks. No. no. Okay. Um, in fact, we don't have enough uh, acacia wood, so we'll need like this. Is that enough? Planks? No. Because we need... I think the gates are the opposite way, if I recall. So we need, like, this. Is this one gate? Yes, it is. Okay, so we do have enough. We need four. So one, two, three, four. We have exactly enough. Nice. Perfect. All right, let's go put them on. Yay. Okay. We don't want to get the sheep first. Oh, uh, yeah, we could probably bring them in this way. Okay. Just cut it open. Yeah, but then we'll end uh, up with cows in here. Yeah. Not if we lead them away first with um, leads. All right. So, um... That music came on quickly. Beautiful. Yeah. As always. All right, so let's grab our leads over here. I don't have many left. Yeah, we have three. We gotta um, kill another wandering trader and take his leads that he carries his llamas around on or with. Oh, uh, we don't have any weed on us either. Damn it. I knew I was forgetting something. Thankfully, oh, it's not too far away. I put the weed back. Yeah, put it away with everything else. Makes sense. I just wasn't paying attention to that. No worries. That bit, I guess. Oh, look what I found. Ah. Do we uh, need that? What? Do we need that? Not that we need it. Um, but over here we have more. Oh. So that's where those go. <laughs> we determined that last time, and just I guess forgot. I was like, does it give again. us luck so that we can? <laughs> Uh, like, do a better job getting the <laughs> sheep in here and not the cows. <laughs> Alright, everybody, come this way. Look, oh my god, it's food. What? If they're having no, no. sex, maybe they won't, uh, they won't come over. It's not technically how it works, I don't think. Like, no. they're, they get delayed momentarily while they start breeding, but... Right, focus over here. Everybody focus over here. Look, oh my goodness, everyone, look, oh my god, there's food. <laughs> okay, now we need the leads on the sheep. Oh god, okay. All right, sheep, let's go. Oh, this is going to be very difficult, isn't it? Yep. 
Get your ass through here. Let's go, let's go, let's go, all three of you, come on. No cows, let's go. Come on. Sheep go, sheep go. No cow. Oh, nice. Got there. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice job. Thank you. All right, sheep, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> come on. You can do it. Nice job, sheep. <laughs> Okay, got all three of the leads. Okay. So we got two more left, three more left? Sheep? Three more, I believe. Maybe it is two. It's three. Okay. You're right. One. Two. Come on. Three. All right. Sheep, if you would. Through the gates, please. No, cows, no. Damn it, I got two of them. All right. Okay. Well, we'll have beef for dinner. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I was just going to say, yeah, we're just going to have to that's, kill them. I think. That's, that's well, fine. you know what? No, we don't have to do that. At least for now, they can stay in there. Exactly. And then we can come back and just lead them into the other area instead. Come on, you three. Hurry up. In we go. All right, now we'll do this. We'll do what Amy suggested and set up our bed and sleep. And so we they... can count the sheep. Nice. <laughs> Very well done. Very well done. It's going to be great. <sighs> I'm upset with you, but it was good. Oh, good. <laughs> That's the best kind of joke. <laughs> One that upsets you and you still think it's good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. You two. You know what? Everybody come this way. Everybody. Everybody come this way. Okay, good. Now, shut the gate. Get the leads off of you two. Pick them up. And we're out. We did it. Yay, very nice. It's not as difficult as I was afraid it was going to be. Good. Okay, well, guess what? Uh, we've got more stuff to do, but that will have to wait until next week's episode because we've definitely done a lot in this one. Yeah. So, thank you all so very much for watching. I really hope everybody enjoyed. Uh, as always, please feel free to leave your thoughts about literally anything and everything down in the comments below. Did you also work at Subway? Do you agree with Amy that uh, the sink was entirely too small? Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you Amazing. Can, uh, anything that you want to talk about at all. I, I don't care. We just want to hear from you. So let us know in the comments down below what you think uh, of our builds, of uh, Amy's ideas with the banners. Are you as confused as I am? Because I, I just, you know, was focused on a lot of other things. So we will uh, try to finish that up next week. Not a worry whatsoever. But uh, before then, please don't forget, if you're enjoying the things that we're doing on this channel, you can subscribe and ring that bell so that you will get notifications whenever any of our videos come out, including the continuation of this series in the coming weeks. Also, as a reminder, we have other series on this channel and other channels. Links down in the description box below for uh, Geek for All, our Magic the Gathering channel. And Gluten Free for All. So you can check those out down in the description box below. You can sub and ring the bells there as well. And you can check out the links to our socials down there too. Uh, and we appreciate you uh, supporting us in all of the different things that we do. So thank you very much for doing so. Hopefully we'll see you live on stream over at Geek For All, all that fun stuff. But for now, from us here at the Geek For All family of channels, I have been Joe. And I'm Amy. And as we always say, in whichever video of ours you watch next, we will see you all next time. Thanks, everybody. <laughs>